going on YouTube. Appreciate you guys tuning into another one of my videos. I decided to sign up for TNS hosted by Tampa Never Sleeps and give my Ermac some runs, bro, because I've been playing Ermac the last couple videos as you've been seeing. Um, but this is the first tournament run with Ermac, man. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Hold on, this is gonna be dirty, bro. Takeda versus Ermac. This shit is hella laggy. Oh yeah, this is horrible. This is like really bad. Oh my god. <laughs> what fatal blow did it come out? Oh no, I tried to put the little shield on and I got stand through. Bro, the ping is 150, dog. Try to do a bombo. I hit that overhead. I wanted to kill. What's the combo though? I look, you forgot that moment. Oh my god, I didn't even want that. Yeah, he gotta be sick to his stomach right now. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> Trying to get in my bag and hit the optimals, bro. Good enter. Damn, bro was in jail right there. Oh my God. I don't know why he, uh, oh my God. Hold on bro, you're scaring me. <laughs> oh. Damn. 
Oh, he gets to throw combo off this. I just did it. Damn, I got shimmy at my jimmies, bro. No, I try to chase him. Bro, do not want to block. Get him off that bar. That's your armor. <laughs> GG's, GG's, bro. GG's, GG's. Very nice to see uh, Rewind exploring different characters. Rawless on the Kenshi and Sub-Zero. Your standard meta for, for this pair. You can't really go wrong. Okay, we got the first hit in. We're oh. not going to get the freeze, though. We're just going to get the shoulder pushback. Yeah, didn't quite believe in that. Committed to something safe. Again, not believing in the commitment. But here we go, the overhead into the cancel. Very easy hit confirm. We're going coast to coast with it. Jesus. To the corner. 316. Oh man. Rollis getting opened up with these auto shimmies back to back, and it is not feeling good. I love the option to go for Another that overhead. Trade. Even though Death's Embrace wasn't getting, uh, or rather, Rewind wasn't getting hit, the Death's Embrace is just for that safety measure, right? I'm not using my meter for anything else except to literally protect me from damage. But that back two was gorgeous from Rawless, and I like that the option to side switch was there. Knew that the breaker was coming from Rewind. Yeah, it was a great hit confirmed there. It looks like he definitely wanted to get Sento out and couldn't quite get him there. Rewind breaking before it got a little too spooky for him. Ooh, Auto shimmy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Combo's not done. Oh my goodness, it's a mid. It was a little bit of American reset there for Rewind, and Rewind coming back with it once more. And again, this corner is entirely belonging to Rewind as a clean hit. We got Rala switching over to Rain and Janet. Which I'm curious to see what's gonna be making the difference here if it's those longer range. Yeah, I'm I'm very interested in this too. I feel like we just saw rain and we're talking about it earlier. A few of the other rain mains, especially like Mandino's been saying rain is not very viable, especially in this meta. 
But it looks like we're off to a great start. Only couple mistakes we're making here off of pokes and the sweep. Gonna launch. Death embrace all this lift screen on me. Goes for the safe jump. Keeps it nice and simple. And gets the combo extension with Janet. It's gonna be a launcher here though for Rawless. Gonna force Rewind to break. Rewind very confident, even though at 94 points of health. Oh my goodness, and that's why he's dead. If we can get a fatal blow here. Oh my god. Oh, didn't come first. Oh, wow. And the wake up. Hold on. Now is doing wonders with the wake up. Securing this first round of rain. Sometimes it's just a reminder that when you try to go for the fancy stuff and not go straight into fatal, it, I feel like they'll probably oh also be skilled as well too. But Ooh. there's that up block here from Rawless calling out what Rewind was cooking. Sweet to answer back. I like that oh, no. we're using Rain's movement to also match uh, Rewind's movement with Ermac. So great oh. defense does get opened up by the overhead though. These overheads are going to work. I think we've only seen Rewind go for the sweep launch one time. But it seems like Rawless is tech? not no. in it. Yeah, he's just different. <laughs> he's just different. Oh no! Oh, Rawless the chip! He almost had it, but the chip closed it out. Fight. Okay, we've got the wall up. Now, this isn't the strongest thing we can do because we do have to worry about Ermac having that teleport. Calls the wall in early. Nice down one check. Catching Rewind, trying to move away. And force them off of all of that meter in the overhead. Oh my goodness. Again. There's no little starter except for the sweep. And this overhead is just going crazy right now. Okay, I like that. Going for the full string. Then push back. Oh, oh the attempt of the whip punish, but rewind was just far enough. And then down one check. There goes the overhead backing away just a little bit. Going for the full string right after and says going for a cancel. Oh my goodness. Oh, got the back three. This is how it starts. Now the only scary part about this, Rewind does have the win condition, but I don't think he's going to get a chance to use it unless he forces the break here. Just enough meter and just enough time. And wow, projectile into the Janet. I don't think I've quite seen that one before, but catches Rewind and puts a point on the board. It, 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 I think I think we're getting confused when it's charged, but either way, even though uh, Rewind was trying to avoid it, it was a bit of the last minute decision, either to jump it or to just try to duck it, and it just didn't work out in that section. But once again, the sweep into the launcher to extend with Janet, safe jump with overhead to continue, and carry corner as well. Oh my goodness, and the damage is getting laid out big time here. 322. One of the autos for me to go. Oh, but the overhead uh, cannon is just cash money. Why go for anything else at this point? We're gonna go for the Janet? Yeah, we are gonna get the extension and just get guaranteed damage. And clap again with the overhead. Rewind, a very dominant showing. I'm telling you, the corner, the rent is cheap. It's just, just gotta be extremely affordable. Forces the break. Morales coming up for all the meter and shuts the whirlpool down. Rawless making his way out. Rewind using Breaker. Going for the stomp. Does jump over Rawless. We're back onto these cancel pressures once again. And we're able to open up Rawless and continue to hopefully get this corner carry. And we do the cannon. It is crazy. Every single touch is essentially guaranteeing we are going to go to the corner. And you're going to have to guess for your life. Wow. Oh, he's not blocking! The press button from the wake up! It is over here for this game as Rewind goes up 2-1 to one against Rollins. But the rain is also... It's also hard to open up because, truthfully, even though both characters have those dash cancels, Ermac's the one that has that stronger movement game. Plus, you're getting meter when you're doing those cancels too, right? So it's like, there's so much in favor right there on just paper, plus rewind. 
being the player that he is. Just playing phenomenally right now. Oh. He got a hit here for Rollis. Good Breaker break. on the freeze. Very nicely timed. Yeah, gonna break while Sub is out. He's gonna make that last a little bit longer on that cooldown for Sub-Zero, but I don't think it's even gonna matter. This is gonna be big damage almost to the corner already. And the overhead again, just working for Rewind time and time again. The Janet call gonna be pushing us clear over 30. Goes for the full string this time. Oh my goodness. Once again, going for the speed. Oh no, the back two's gonna get punished. No, it was too wow. slow. Oh, wow. Round two. That is insane. Tried to get the fatal blow to work. Just no dice, but we do have a full stick of butter. If we get caught up, we won't have to deal with it, but chooses to armor instead. I think the biggest issue Rallis has been having is every time he gets a hit on Rewind, he has meter to break. Wow, what a pickup from the sweep. Death's embrace, all this looks to me on me. Goes for the safe jump into the back row. We're gonna be seeing Janet again. Safe jump again. Nice armor. The response to utilize oh. armor for that, but the back two is not projectile, so that is gonna go through the ice armor. And we have the lift. Oh, he's dead. Oh, we got Gento! Force Big the break. Stomp goes out. Once again, the ice armor is good here. here. Gonna be able to avoid the all oh, stomp with the double down one anti air that best embrace just because why not? Oh man, and the brutal rewind throwing good hands and souls three to one. What a showing! But you could Mm-hmm, keeps you doing it.
he did that. Just no one else is not blocking, but he... Haha, uh -huh, I got the first hit. <laughs> oh my god, he keeps doing it. Oh, you're good. He's having a blast. Give me all the meter. <laughs> I'll take it. It's not launching. Say less. God damn it. <laughs> I hate doing these on the side. Bro, I up blocked, man. Like, that's a bad non break, buddy. He did it again. He just keeps doing it. smart enough but he's probably just trying to go for a shimmy Blog was so hard to block. And I can't do none of that. Uh Block the spring life 50 times. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. <laughs> Dumbass auto shimmy, bro. That already feels annoying. <laughs> Just 
I just didn't have any meter. It wasn't going to do anything. It, it takes your meter, so if you don't got a meter, it doesn't do anything. This just shows how dumb Sedell is, bro. I was trying to stop him from tossing out the low hat and just doing that, but I had nothing to stop him with. And I can't zone him back with shit. We're so bad. Like, I said I was gonna play Erme only the whole time. <laughs> you want me? It's, she's annoying for all my characters, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> she's annoying for Reiko. She's annoying for Shao. She's annoying for Lee Bay. I don't actually have an answer for Sindel in reality. Who's that, too? Stupid ass mix up, bro. That's so fucking micro. Oh my god, bro. Like, <laughs> this is why we just go overhead, man. Oh 
jump is. Anything. If I throw, if I do this, he's gonna just jump. So it's like, fuck it out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? end of the day i didn't even play bad like i just have to guess <laughs> i have to sit there and guess bro i'm about to get hard to blockable after getting hard to blockable by the other news Love you, put me on. Bro, I got input there. What the fuck I tried down for? Bro just did down for and then swung. Should have did it right there. Just couldn't think fast enough. No way. I figured he was going to do that too. has like the best check ever. Got it back just in time. <laughs> That's great. I was trying to stop him from putting down the low hat, and I died for trying to stop him from putting down the low hat. 
I tried to do the 4-4-3 string to go over the hat, and he held the hat, and I landed on the hat, and got full combo punished for landing on top of the hat, trying to get over the hat. <laughs> That's what I get, huh? And I have no meter. Baby combo, a little 20% into safe jump. I got the stupid green shield and I got punished immediately. Like, come on. He's gonna keep jumping back because I can't do shit about it. Look at this. I can't do nothing about him doing this. always punished after the down one but I guess he was just wanting to re-grab that bad I wish I could stop him from jumping back it's so annoying just watching him jump back and I can't stop him it's really pissing me off because his teleport is too slow oh, wow I got an input there
Oh my god, bro. Just get big, bro. I was gonna bait it too. I was like, is he really gonna do this right here? Oh, of course he's really, huh? Like, I really just gotta get clipped by. Th lo throw low hat down, teleport, and then I try to avoid the low hat and I get full combo for 50. Like, I'm odd, bro. Oh, my God. I didn't believe. I have to wait for it to actually land because if I don't, um, it's gonna whiff. <laughs> I tested it. Like, what is that? Like, what? Oh my god, bro. And he did it, bro. Like. <laughs> I was so I was gonna be so mad if that didn't actually punish. And I got, oh, got it over there. I could have killed. This isn't gonna kill. This game is so stupid.
Oh, yeah. We are going to see the Ermac rewind and dial off the run back. Go. We got our. We kind of got a lore match too going. Oh yeah, that's true. Kinda, kinda. Yeah. We just had the Gerard. Jared. Jared. No sub. Oh my goodness, the overhead. I was actually gonna say that the the engagement ring. <laughs> <laughs> he went to Jared. The song. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> the big wake up into the standard piece. Goes for the pay jump. And we're gonna get another Janet call here. Dialogue opened up with the auto shimmy from Rewind. NJP keeps it safe. Oh, and he wanted an anti air. Couldn't quite get it. And no meter to break. Gonna have to go for the drive. What's the mix? We do not care. No mix. No mix right there. It's just armor. <laughs> Oh, oh no! no way. That was this an input error. Real. That had to be an input error. No way that's real. That is unfortunate. Round two. Fight. How unfortunate there. Oh, it looks like he thought he was gonna have a hit confirm there, catching rewind back dash and no dice. Did get the pick up elsewhere. Oh no, that is not the answer. And Mari claiming the code. We gotta say a big shout out to Mari. <laughs> there we go, Mari. <laughs> Now, I do want to say here, uh, Rewind is dropping a lot, so hopefully we can get some of these cleanups, uh, especially now, right, where we're getting this corner dominance. The throw tech, very nice, that one check. The overhead gets hit by the armored launcher. Oh my goodness, and speaking of armored launchers, again. Overhead again, oh, overhead is the fatal. Ooh. This, look how much that hit, by the way, for the pen. That pen was so potent. Yeah, that's pure, it's pure gold right there. That's solid. Final round, fight. A powerful pen. Finishes the string. Oh, the auto shimmy. Opening rewind up. Ooh. Mm -hmm. One of the here. Yeah. Jumping back. Good stuff. Rewind with the spacing. Gonna get a pickup. Forces that lock to break immediately. Ooh, I like the stomp. You narrowly avoided the uh, Melina size. Yeah, and the low. Completely thread the needle there. <gasps> oh no. no! That is big damage here as Dialogue's gonna be able to solidify the first game of the studio run back. The design in general puts a lot better and cooler design choices than you've seen with the hammer. Oh my gosh, already a strong start here. Katana mm. and lift. We could be looking for up block there. Didn't get it. But Gannett doing the thing, giving the extension. We want leaving damage on the table there. Oh, interesting. Janet was summoned before in anticipation for the launcher. And uh, instead, after Dylock oh, right. the armored, uh, armored launcher, got hit by Janet. But it's Dylock who still gets the corner. Look at the scan. He's dead. Oh, he is the commander. Yeah, he's definitely dead. He is so dead. Oh, doesn't get the jump in. I thought he was going to get it that time. 110 for his troubles. Gets a good throw. Good up block. Oh, and just the buttons were a little too stubby for the pickup that Rewind was looking to get there. Yeah, one of those uh, strict situations with up block. If you don't have the range, it's gonna be a little tough. Good tag. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Like we have a lot of interrupts happening right now from between the two, but it's Rewind who finally gets the pick in and the corner theory. Dialogue is still building up that third bar. 
Nice clean hit into the back throw here. I'm sorry, forward throw. I'm so used to seeing the back throw. Yeah. <laughs> like Dai says that it's the, it's the back throw, but here we go. The Janet call for the extension. Doesn't quite kill, but the chip will do. All these hands all over. Players with a very much healthy amount of resources, but again, that up lock not close enough for a punish, and having to use all of that meter after getting it through into those cancels. We're gonna go for the back throw fully. No Janet, just wanting that corner position, but the Katana fan coming through and still, despite the drop, Dialog able to get this extension with the Melina size. Oh, actually blocks and ducks the back forward too to get the punish. And that is gonna cost him. Whoa! Wow. A one attempted wake up, 43. And we do see you guys playing all these match arena folks. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you so much. Hello, Axe once again. He picked up off of it. No way. That's insane. The call out from the Molina Canyo does the job there of getting some extra damage. We're all canceling the base. Okay. A lot of folks here from Rewind, but nothing leading into what he's looking for. Dialog getting the back throw. The low hit and plus the Jade Blade, but Breaker from Rewind and was able to narrowly avoid the Axe Slam. So that's a full cool jump in from the opening that he was looking for. Okay. Yeah. Forced the break there. Janet Cole would have certainly gotten the kill. No way. No, the returning blade into Fatal. Now this is going to scale. The big question is, is it going to scale enough for Rewind to survive it? That's gonna be pretty close. The boot to the chest. Narrowly surviving this and went for the teleport on wake up. Expecting dialogue to try and press something. Check overhead though from Rewind. There we go. Look at the lift. And the bounce. Janet. Corner all the way through. Load into the overhead once again. If you did not guess correctly, this is Rewind Corner. Oh goodness. This is crazy. Watch your ankles. Unable to get the punish on the down one. And great blocks on the overhead from Weewine. Hold on. Is able to close out with the throw combo? Not quite, but the chip will do. So done there from Rewind. Great uh, comeback potential here. Still has a lot to work with, but this is the momentum that can definitely change. This is Rewind, of course. Oh no, he wanted to pick up there and just couldn't quite get it slightly this time. Nice down one check. Nice. Oh, the bait on the up block. It's gonna be 14%, but the armor back forward too wasn't close enough to get this full uh, restem pressure. Okay, standing one. Nice little 17% into the safe jump. Off the ankles. Okay. Was going to be able to get a decent pick up there. Force the break. Rewind. Holding on to his meter. Wake up down one. Hoping the sweep would launch. And the overhead. Nobody with no second chances. This is going to be scary. No meter on the board. The up block for the anti-air. Oh man, Rewind bet it all on the jump in. And Dialogue was just, do you guys see that chair explode in the background? I'm not even trying to be funny. Like, I did, I did, I did. I had to. <laughs> that is so poetic. The run back and the chair pop off happening in game. That is insane. <laughs>